on stage you have a persona that you don't really show up at the Sunday dinner yeah. with your parents. <laughs> so it's sort of, you know, they have to get, you know, they have to accept that. But it's, I wonder what goes through their mind, what their daughter, daughter is up to. For a month, I had the same outfit for every show. I started to get, I had plastic pants, so I started to get sits on my legs and stuff, so I had to change. So now I'm starting on my new month with the same outfit, so yes, I know. <laughs> Your new because outfit of, is great. Yeah, it's I have like a new really good cool. one, yes. I don't ever feel like a sex symbol. And it's uh, just a weird uh, disease of this business, too. Whoever's on TV is supposed to be either good looking or, or sexy, even though, I mean, I was never considered or considering myself anything beyond everybody else before I joined this, and I still don't. It's a very, very weird phenomenon. So, no, I don't, and I don't particularly enjoy being one either. What did you hear me say? I think he felt that, that he wasn't 100% into going on tour. You know, he wasn't really psyched about it. And I mean, if, you, if you're not really looking forward to go on tour, you, you shouldn't. What did you hear me say? I said, you know, if we're gonna have someone else, you know, that's not Magnus. Yeah, it's Phil or nothing. During these years, I think we've sort of grown into more of a rock band than like two first albums were more pop. Today I want to be a rock band. Well, we've come to the end of this week's show, but of course we're back with the best in music and entertainment on next week's show. Same time, same place, same channel. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.